points that we raise, we don't want to formalize that to share with our parliamentarians some of our concerns and what we think can work to make this uh, our consuming public, in particular our customers, putting the power back into their hands. Because that's what it's all about. I have a responsibility to the depositors mm -hmm. and the people of Jamaica. Mm -hmm. It is against that responsibility that I seek to do what I have done. Mm -hmm. I don't believe it's anything special. It's a duty. That's what we are here for. Persons, Jamaicans have brought the concerns to my attention and in fact opened my eyes mm -hmm. to many things that I never even realized was happening to my own account. Mm -hmm. That is the basis on which I commenced that a couple of years ago, mm -hmm. in, in, in 2013. Uh, so it's a matter of duty. Mm -hmm. You know, we are elected to represent and be the voice of the Jamaican people. I think the parliamentarians have been reasonable in the sense that we've been given an extension in which to continue the discussion and the debate. And that is, uh, that is all we ask for, more collaboration, and co collaboration and a collaborative approach. There are some current regulations by the Bank of Jamaica through the government which they claim um, are impeding efficiency and so forth. As a member of parliament and as a member of that committee, I gave the undertaking that I will um, initiate discussion through the, raise it, bring it to the committee mm -hmm. and use the committee channel to address those things. Okay. So those are some of the most general global issues which are impairing or impeding the efficiency of their banking practices right. as from their perspective. That's one. But in respect to the bill itself, mm -hmm. I have made it clear what the objective of the bill is, mm -hmm. which is to provide protection for the depositors' funds. Mm -hmm. And I emphasize the distinction between depositors mm -hmm. and customers. Right. The bill doesn't speak to anything regarding someone walking into a bank and make a transaction. Mm -hmm. It only relates to transactions made on their account, subsequent to their having a deposit with that bank. That is what the bill is focusing on. To the extent that the bill in their view might go beyond that, mm -hmm. then I'm prepared to have a look at that mm -hmm. and to address it. And, and Mr. Jackson, I commend him for what he's doing because about people. And I do believe that from this point, it's, it's really working closer together so we can, uh, at the same time, uh, you know, just ensure that we're all on the same path.